Hi, welcome to episode 32 of Minecraft Bedrock, and to, my name is Sunny, and today we are going to be starting with building our tree. Now, the tree I am talking about, this keeps moving, you know? I'm not quite sure. I mean, it looks kind of cool in here, but... Nope. Oopsie, wrong way. Back there. Are you supposed to be able to do this? <laughs> I'm not quite sure you're supposed to be able to do this, you know? Really not. Anyways. Um. Yeah, this is Sunny Season Sports. Finished last episode. And, um, yeah. If we can get something in that thing, like a villager, that'd be nice. But we can't right now, so that's okay. Um. Um. Do I want the keys? I'll leave them. Okay, now, this is my mangrove tree. Now, these, I got some more roots, and I went down and cut down a tree so I could have a tree to base off of. Or have a tree so I can have the stuff. Um, yeah. So, this is what I went to, um, do. And, yeah. So. Get my mangrove roots. I have other stuff, too, but I only need this right now. And then this breaks. Perfect. And then this direction, they're going to spread out like that. Okay. And then we need to build the actual tree part. I have some propagule. Right, mangrove locks. I mean, I'm going to like build up the roots around this. Then we're going to go up with the locks. Then we're going to go like this, that, and I want that back, okay, and then this one can go, uh, 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 uh. And this is going to go like this. Perfect. Break all the dirt. <gasps> baby turtles, baby turtles, baby turtles! They're adorable! <gasps> Don't you touch. Don't you touch. Don't touch the baby turtles. Monsters nearby. Eh, one monster. I would not consider this a monster nearby. Come on, how nearby is nearby? Okay, I'll just slay this one minute. Maybe I won't. Wow, there's a lot of monsters nearby now. Okay, that's nice. That's some string. If I was going string hunting, this might work. Go to sleep and deal with half this problem. Half this problem dealt with. You're not a monster. You're adorable. Okay. Perfect. Issue dealt with. <gasps> what are you doing? You tried to kill my baby turtles. Baby turtles, I'm sorry! There's still two of you, though, right? Yep. You must be Mama. So where's... Where's your babies? There's baby one. There's baby two. You're safe! What a relief. You guys are safe. Don't you worry. I got you. Safe from those skeletons. Don't you worry about it. Wait, what? I thought I killed a... Huh, it says I have a bad omen. There in the corner. Which is weird because I only killed a zombie. Unless it was a villager zombie. Or maybe I had this when I started the episode. I don't remember, so I'm just gonna say that I had this when I started the episode. Huh. I forgot... to get some leaves. So now we have a tree and no leaves. I'll get some leaves, don't worry. Hello, pig. Um, let's see. Let's put that there. That 
there, 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 there. Okay, leaves. Which I need iron so I can have some shears. Do I have iron on me? No. Did I use all my iron? Probably. I might have to go leafless. Nope, I have two iron. Perfect. I mean, I have more than two iron, but I don't need it to. Um, let's see. Shears, shears, shears. I think they're like this, aren't they? Nope. There we go. I was right. Perfect. We're going to leaf a tree. The tree I made might not there. I might have not got all the wood from it. That saves me some time. This is not the fastest method, but it is the now used one. Just swimming straight ahead. Swimming. Meaning a turtle. Swimming. The reason I was so worried about the zombies, by the way, let's talk about the skeletons. I didn't think skeletons did it, but the zombies will stomp on turtle eggs. Um, so I had to make sure that the turtles were safe. Okay, this is still dropping, but there is time to get the leaves. Let's go. Okay. Okay, let's just get some leaves. Cut down some wood. I tried to find the most wood I could out of this, but it apparently did not go well, because there is still... Still wood. So I apparently am not the most efficient wood finder. That's okay, I'll just break this by hand. One, and two, and three, okay. Three, and broken. Oh, four, okay. Oop, five. Okay. Back to shearing. I mean, there's, I can shear this because the tree's going away anyways, and the only way to actually get the leaves is to shear. So I'm initiating shearing process. My shears are gone, so that's it. That's as many leaves as I'm getting. Better to break these logs. One. Two. Three. Oopsie. Three and four. Perfect. There we go. Perfect. That's a lot of things. We're going to pick them all up. Or we'll have more than enough leaves for everything. Because when you shear leaves, like, you always, like, shear leaves. And, like, oh, maybe that's not enough leaves. But then when you shear, it's like it's just a one-block break. And it's like, shear, shear, shear. And then you always get more leaves than you ever actually need. Unless you're doing a really big build, most of the time it's more leaves than you ever actually need. Nice. Uh, it's fish spinning. Fish circles. Fish circles. Okay. My theme song's done. Don't worry. Let's go. Baby turtle. Back with the bouncy method. Bounce, bounce, bounce. Bouncing, bouncing, bouncing. Bouncing. So yeah, Minecraft characters in Bedrock, they blink. See, so if you keep looking at me, I'm gonna blink. Get ready. There we go. That was a blink. I think they blink longer sometimes than others. Yeah, see, I've got almost four stacks of leaves. There's probably too many, but 
Oh, it's a frog. She just wanted to join in my my ingrowness. Oopsie. Okay, we're here. It is time to leave. Oh, we're gonna have a blue mangrove tree. Okay. I'm gonna go with like the random method. Um, I'm gonna place leaves. If I don't like where they end up, I'll just break them. However, I do think it has to be fully leafed. So, let's see what that looks like. Not very good. Let me break this, and then we'll work out that problem. In two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. Okay. So yeah, this is a custom-built mangrove tree. How good I am at it remains to be seen, but, I mean, it doesn't look that bad in my opinion. Doesn't look like the worst. Let's get a good, better view of this. Hi, frog! Okay, there's a little bit of work to be done up at the top. Mounting the heights! Okay, this... Has to be covered. Okay, this has to be done. It was this corner that looked weird, wasn't it? Let's see, let's check the other corners too. Nothing, nothing. This should definitely have a drop to it. Okay. I'll check out what that looks like as soon as I remember to fill in the hole I made just then. Let's check that out. Let's eat some food so we don't die on our mission to finish this tree. Two. Three. Perfect. Perfect. And then, let's take a look at that. Okay, that looks good, that looks good. So, let's check the back end. Okay, that needs a little bit more. Yep, and this is another good reason to get, like, a bunch of extra leaves, because, like, they can just, like, be used like this. That one. So, yeah, the good reason to get a bunch of extra leaves is that they can be used in case you run out. So, yeah, this is my tree. Um, that's a penguin. Let's sleep. There we go. That's a cow. Just to point that out, that is a cow. And let's go back. So, I think, actually, hold up, slow down, turn around. Ah, oh, some skeleton spawn. Well, okay, I need some fences. My oak trees grew. I gotta get to my oak trees. Without dying. This is a difficult endeavor. But it shall be done. Oh wait, I have stuff for fences on me. Nice. And then some oak. Perfect. 
Now what we're going to do is we're going to just hang these fences down. Now this isn't a tree with a lot of types of wood, so it doesn't really work as well, I don't think. But it still does, um, it still does work, I'd say, just not as well as if it had, like, a lot more types of trees. So, yeah, I feel like more type, uh, more wood in the tree would be ideal. But for now, that looks pretty good. Let's add some vines to it. Those will grow. Hi, cow. If I have any... Here's some mud. This needs to be filled with water, but let's make the bottom part mud. I might want a crafting table. So I can make a shovel. So I can break this crafting table. Then I can observe the fact that I have slabs on me. So let's see what those look like. I like do it like there and then just like up in like the hollows but not like too many because you don't want too many slabs I've never done this before if that if that encourages anybody or dissuades them because I've never done this before this is my first time attempting to make a custom tree and I have no idea how these things are supposed to turn out so first time custom tree so yeah we'll see how it goes in my opinion it looks okay still in my opinion it looks like a good tree still and it should be fine yeah, I can stay. So yeah, in my opinion, it looks like a good custom tree, and it can definitely stay. Um, but, of course, it's not a professional custom tree. I am not a professional. <laughs> Contrary to popular belief. I'm joking, it's probably not popular belief. Um, yeah, I have never done that before. First time, might be good. Um, yeah, it might be. I'm going to consider it good, pretty good for a first time. That's what I'm going to go with. Let's see anything else here. Mud. Well, I might as well make it all mud, you know? I do kind of like the stone, though, to give it some variation. Okay. So let's add a few more stone. If I have any, I don't. So we're going to add... Ooh, some cobblestone. I have that. Okay, nice. Let's just add some cobblestone around... That's too connected. That is too connected. That's okay, and then one right there. Mud. Eh, I'll just leave the cobblestone on the edges. Ding! Perfect. Mud time. Everybody's favorite step. My mud, thank you. There we go. Ooh, I might run out of mud. This is an issue. This is an issue. I'm out of mud. Okay. Then we'll just use some dirt. And I have a few more pieces of... Oh, five more pieces of mud. Okay. I can finish this then, and then this. Nope, not there. Here. Dirt patch. Actually, I want a dirt patch right there, and then I want, like, some mud right here, and then the rest dirt. Perfect. 
perfect. This is landscaping at its finest. Definitely does seem to start over here, too. Now I've started patching. I'm going to have to keep patching. Okay. Perfect. Now, next step. It has to be filled with water. This is an infinite water source, so I don't even have to go anywhere. That's not, though. Okay, this is not an infinite water source. Lesson learned. Okay, that's fixed. This is an infinite water source. That isn't. Okay. And yes, I can only use infinite water sources to get my things. Otherwise, things break. Perfect. Now, while we're here discussing, I've noticed I'd mentioned the quick play on the Create Mod last episode. So let's see. What else can I manage? Um, hmm. Um, I don't know what else to mention. I could mention that this, um, I could say Happy Valentine's Day if I forgot to do that a long time ago. Um, I probably did, yep. I think I almost definitely forgot to say Happy Valentine's Day a while ago. But you never know, I might have. Um, and what else? go. That's an infinite water source in the corner. Okay. Yeah, so let's see. There's not another holiday, is there? Because it's the end of February. I mean, this year's a leap year. I know that. All years divisible by four are leap years. If you're watching this in the future, this year's 2024, so this is a leap year. And that means that there is 366 days in the year instead of 365, as you probably know. And in conclusion, there's one extra day to play Minecraft! Yay! Or do something. It doesn't necessarily have to be play Minecraft. Now, I don't know if that day is a weekend. Let me calculate. It might be. No, I think it is. I think it is. I think it's a weekend. So that means playing Minecraft is an option in case you were busy on weekdays. I'm not sure if I'd, um, I don't know if I'm recommending playing Minecraft here, but it is a valid option. So, um, what else do I have to say? You know, what other interesting subjects have I got in my book of apparently not so interesting subjects, seeing as I can't really think of them? Um... Hmm. This mangrove root is not cooperating. Uh. Oh, I know how to fix this. Gotta do this. This, this. Place water on it. Pick it out. And it fixes. Nice. Okay, let's keep going. I'm gonna probably have a few of these problems. Um. Yeah, because mangrove roots water lock. Okay, so to fix this. Just demonstrated how. Okay, I've just demonstrated how, so I think what I need to do is do this. There. Dump some water there. That's sleep. I mean, this sun looks cool setting, but that does mean we have to sleep. 
There we go. Perfect. Now, I think the most important matter of business is naming our tree. What do you think we should name our tree? Um, suggestions can be taken, will be taken, maybe. Um, I would preferably, if, please name, put some suggestions down in the comments. I would like names that, um, I suppose they could, they might, might relate to the fact that this mangrove tree, it can relate to, um, what else could a mangrove tree relate to? There's gotta be an infinite water source here. Anyways, um, the, let's see, this is a tree, so maybe just some, like, really fancy names. Now, what I mean by fancy names is things like, okay, I need to stop doing that. What I mean by fancy names is things like, um, William Benedict the, the, the fifth senior. That's a fancy name. So things like that. They don't have to be serious. I mean, it's like if you put in serious in the fact that if you put a, 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 uh, what, what am I trying to say here? If you put a, Benedict, William, I'm doing this opposite round now, I'm uh, if you put like a Benedict William the 16th junior, <laughs> think about that for a minute. It means that William Benedict, or Benedict William, or whatever he felt like his name was, is Junior. So instead of calling the next son William the 17th, they called him William the 16th Junior. So William the 16th, again, because they must have just really liked the sound of the 16th or something. There we go. It's not a perfect fix, but it is a pretty good lake. I don't quite know all the issues with it, but theoretically. No, okay, don't quite know how to fix it, but this is a tree. You can suggest names, preferably the ones like I just suggested, and thank you very much for watching. Thank you for liking, subscribing, and commenting, and I'll see you in the next one.